M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So SD card and RT systems. If you look at the RT system software, it doesn't actually show a section where you can read from the SD card, but you can do this. I'll show you how. So what you do, you go menu, set, go to SD card, go up to the top, and what you want to do is go to import, export here. Cl click import, uh, let's get it right, export. Click export, and then go repeater list. And then, and then you can select new file and it will call, give it a name and then push enter and it will do that. Okay. Then go to the next one. You can do GPS memory, new file. There's nothing to, nothing to save, so we're not going to do that one. Next one down, memory channels. Okay, new file, enter. And then, yes, and it's going to export that file to the SD card. Nice and quick. Now your call sign memory, new file, enter. Yes, don't forget, you can use these files in all kinds of uh, ICOM software, but we'll just look at it, RT systems. Any more, got memory channel, your call, repeater list, and GPS memory. So we'll back out, and then what we'll do, we'll go down to, and select unmount, It'll give you the error, click yes, and it now says that we can now take out our SD card, and as you know, you just it's a bit fiddly, but you push it like so, and then probably need tweezers to get it in there, and then take it out and put it in your PC. Okay, let's start with the blank sheet on our RT systems. Put the SD card in the PC, so there's the file in your USB drive coming up. So let's just close that, and then what we're going to do now, we're going to go File, Import, and we're going to look at our this PC. We've got USB drive here, double click, and the one I've been going to is CSV file, double click that, and let's just choose memory channels, double click, and you'll find the file that we've got there, that's it, so we'll go next, but be careful to put in semicolon, once you put in semicolon, then just go next, next, finish, and look, there is all your memory channels, I didn't realize I had so many, let's have a look at DR memories, which it has populated, now that could have been from previous ones, but if you look in your CSV file selections, we go file, uh, that's going to say an export, let's go to memories, file, uh, import, we'll go back to CSV, USB drive, double click, CSV, and look, we've got repeater list, so let's try it, repeater list, click open, and we'll go next, let's choose semicolon again, next, next, finish yeah it's saying more channels than were available but it has done something look you can see it working now dr mount there can only be a hundred it says there in that bank and you have several banks in a in um in a icon 50 so i'm just what i'm saying is that you can import things from direct from the sd card whether it's worth it is another matter altogether but it can be done if you want to play around with just an sd card in your pc and your icon 705 software is entirely up to you. It's just me playing around with the iPhone 705. 73, thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on air. All the best.